In this video, I will be showing you guys the best recording settings for your low-end computers. And I'm gonna be going through the best settings for your X264 encoder. Also, after you follow this video until the end, you will know how you can fix the lagginess. So without any further ado, let's jump right into the video. Alrighty, so as you guys can see, I have opened up OBS. So simply, you know, click on view at the top and you click on docs and go ahead and enable this stats window. After that, this window should open up and just place it anywhere in your interface. And from this window, you can get the FPS. And if your recording lags a lot, you can get all the information from this stats window. Alrighty, and now we can go ahead and open up the settings window and go ahead and go up to the output tab and go ahead and change the output mode to advanced and click on recording and as the type you can choose standard recording part you can simply select the location where you need to save your video files and as the recording format you can select mp4 also you can select mov but i would recommend you guys to choose mp4 because all the editing software supports mp4 so you won't get any problems regarding the mp4 format audio tracks you can select one or two audio tracks and do not go about two audio tracks as the encoder go ahead and select your x264 encoder and go ahead and come to this part and this is where all the magic happens so simply you want to change the rate control to cbr and as the bitrate you can select a value like let's say if you have a pretty bad computer you can select a value between 2500 to 8000 and if you have a pretty good computer you can select a value between 8000 to 15000 and do not go above 15000 I would say select a value like the bitrate value around 10,000 is pretty good so just like that but obviously you can play with these settings and after you get lagginess after you put these settings go ahead and lower down the bitrate a bit more and should fix the lagginess and then as the CPU usage you can select ultra fast and the profile should be at a high and the tune should be none and right here you can I'm just gonna delete this so I can show you what to do on this box so i will put some quotes down in the description so you can just copy that so you just wanna simply wanna copy this code right here which is for x264 options just copy that right click and copy that up and just paste it right here and then you wanna keep a space and again open up my description and if you want low latency you can just copy this code and if you want a max quality you can copy this code so i'm just gonna copy this code and then you can simply paste it right here and then click on apply and go to the audio tab you can change the audio bitrate to 320 and go up to the advanced tab and make sure that your process priority is set to above normal so when i was recording with obs i at the pole it's using high but once i change that to above normal it's like completely remove the slugginess from your recording so make sure that your process priority is set to above normal and it will fix the lagginess and then you can go up to the video tab and as the base canvas resolution you can select the monitor resolution output resolution you can select the same as your base canvas resolution and when recording in hd if your recording selects a lot you can just lower this down to 1280 by 720. so as the downscale filter you can select lankers sharpen scale in 36 samples and as this one at default it will have in common fps value go ahead and change that to fraction of ps value and as the denominator, you can select the FPS that you want to record your videos in. And as the denominator, you can select one and should always stays at one. And then you can simply click on apply and click on OK. And now go ahead and record a test video. And now it should fix all the lagginess and also it should increase the quality of your videos. Still, if you're recording lags a lot, this is a quick tip on how you can fix that lagginess. So congrats if you are still here in this video so yeah let's see what is the fix so as you guys can see right here i have disabled the preview and right now if i open up my task manager so as you guys can see now my obs is using 23 to 25 percent of my cpu like at average it should be at 22 or something like that so it's simply just using 22 percent of my cpu and if i enable the preview and if i open up my task manager and boom it the cpu usage has been increased to like 30 percent so this is a quick tip how you can fix the lagginess in your recording simply just right click and disable the preview and it should fix all the lagginess from your recordings so yeah guys that's it for today's video if you found this video helpful please be sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel and i will catch you guys on my next video peace